I say this is the beginning of force fetch video, but really this video is just going to be, well this later on it will be force fetch, we'll probably all put it together. But we're starting out right now with hold. So I'm going to show Nathaniel's video and I'm going to show him what he needs to practice and work with her on. But what you're going to need is you're going to need your check cord, you're going to need a leather glove and a collar. So I'm going to put her collar on so we can put the check cord. So what she's probably going to want to do is pull back. And I don't remember if it was in Chris's video or not. One thing I remember with Rocky was he would try to pull his head back. So we'll squeeze. If you got something else besides a truck bed, you don't have a truck, if you can use anything, but something to get her up to eye level with you is really nice to work with. Otherwise, you're gonna be bending over a lot, but I'm gonna hook this to her. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stand on this, make it kind of semi-tight where she can't pull away. And I put the glove on my left hand this might be a rodeo at first, I don't know, let's see, she, see if she likes it. So gloves on my left hand, and then I'm going to stick in my hand in her mouth, and I'm going to say hold, okay? But you got to clear her lips, so you don't say nothing, just clear the lips and say hold. Oh, good. Good, good. Hold, hold, leave. Okay, she was fighting me, and I'm not expecting much from her right now, so I'm going to put my hand in, clear her lips. Make sure she's not biting her own teeth. Let's say hold. Good. Good. She's actually already holding. Oh, see how they start? Hold. Good. Leap. Good girl. This would probably take a couple days of her like almost semi gagging or pulling away. But once, probably after a couple days, if you do it like, I would suggest doing it like three times a day because I used to do it once a day and I remember it was not enough. Like they're not grasping it. You're not doing enough. So just three times a day, put the glove on, get like this, put your hand in, and just grab around the bottom jaw and clear her lips, make sure she's not biting her own her own gums. Say hold, good. See, she actually does good for about three seconds and then she pulled back. Hold, no, hold. Good girl, good girl. Leave, that's it, okay? At some point, she's gonna stop resisting me. <laughs> But she really doesn't actually, the first three seconds, she's not moving at all, and then you can start feeling her tongue pushing against it and like pulling back. See, she's almost wanting to grab my hand. She probably likes it. She loves to carry things. Hold. Good girl to hold. Leave. Even if you want to make it shorter. See, she didn't fight me at all. See how she's almost wanting to reach for it now? You ever think that confuses them when you say good girl to hold? No. Okay, what happens is, what you got to be careful with, like saying too much, you know? And I said in the video I did the first time with Rocky is almost just pet their shoulder and say, good girl to hold, like really lightly. But if I'm patting their head, they're like, good girl. They're gonna wanna let go. Yeah. So you gotta be really careful how you praise them. Come on, sit. <laughs> Lazy sit. thing. All right. <laughs> That's what they're gonna do with this. This is not, a, this is one of the harder things. Good girl. Okay, watch it. So I'm gonna put it in, <coughs> grab her bottom jaw, say hold. Good girl, good girl to hold, leave. See, she's already holding it. Mm -hmm. Now we'll say her, this is the very first time guys we've done this, very, very first time. I will say she's holding her top of her jaw off my glove yeah, a little bit. She's I not really that. holding it, okay? But that's okay. She's not gagging, she's not going crazy and fighting it almost like she wants it. Hold, good. Grab it now. Hold. Good girl. Leave. Good girl. Good girl. She likes a lot of praise too, I've noticed. We'll probably stop right there. I don't even think that was what, three or four minutes? Not that long at all. Maybe tonight, do one or two more. Now. And I'm talking to Nathaniel guys with you watching at the same time. But I would, I bet you by day three, if not before, she'll just grab you and hold you. And maybe just do it for between. For the first day, maybe only do it for like five seconds max, but make sure, are you okay with saying leave? Yeah, I Do you I want like to say leave. something else? No. Okay. That sounds good. So, a lot of people don't like that. I just did it because that's what Chris Sakens did. If you guys want to say drop or, I mean, I don't know. Some people say uh, give. Some people say dead, which whatever. It really doesn't matter what word you say. I just say leave. 
because I want him to leave it, leave it to me. I don't know. And yeah. that's what Chris does. Sometimes when you're watching training videos, it's just easier to do what they do instead of trying to make up your own stuff. Retail's wagon, she ain't stressed out. We only did it for three or four minutes. I'd rather do that than do it for 10 minutes and start getting frustrated. And me and Nathaniel already know we've experienced that because we pushed her too far when she was doing really good. All of a sudden, five minutes later, she's not. And it's because she's, she's done. And she's, how old is she now? She'll be eight months. So today's Tuesday, this Thursday, she'll this be Thursday, eight months. This Thursday, eight months, okay. I'm trying to think of anything else I could tell you guys. This, there'll be more to this video. This ain't the end of the video, but I'm just trying to get some things knocked out. But that's, I found that to really work good for me. Collar, check cord, leather glove on the left hand if you're a right-handed person. That way you can clear the lips and stroke the shoulder. I wouldn't touch her around on the head when she does good. I would just kind of stroke the shoulder like a good girl to hold when she's doing it. She's not, she's going like this, don't say that. Yeah. Anyway, I think that's it. And she's right now, she's two days from being eight months and she is 57 point. 56.4. 56.4 pounds. We were like yesterday or something. Yeah. I know the first thing we showed you is holding with the glove. Do you want to show that first? So Because we never showed the next step. Look, put the glove on the left hand. Hold. She's holding like, you can tell she's actually holding. Kind of shoulder stroke, good girl. She's doing good. Leave. And boom, easy. All right, now let's move to the next step with the roller. You guys haven't even seen this yet. He's only been doing this since last night. So this is really quick. This is only like her third or fourth time doing it. Clear the lips. Make sure she's not chewing her own lip. Hold. Saying hold. 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 No problems. Money. Leave. That's literally, that's like her third time? Fourth time doing that? Yeah, fourth time. It's not even been 24 hours, guys. She's doing awesome. Soft mouth. She's not toying with it, playing with it. So now, again, I don't remember if I said this on the first one, but it, it's best to keep your foot on the thing like he's doing so she can't jerk her head around. Since she passed that phase, that's like phase, we'll call that phase two. We're gonna move to phase three, which is ear pinch. Now, this is where you lose a lot of people right here because people think you're really hurting the dog. You're, they Sometimes they might little, throw a little whine or a little yip out. You're not. You're barely putting any pressure. When I was doing Rocky, you're just putting your nail into his ear. Both, you know, both nails like this. And you're not cranking down, guys. You don't have to do it. Don't be afraid to do it. I get it. We don't we love our dogs. We don't want to hurt them. And a lot of people will not force fetch their dogs because of this. And in my opinion, that's a horrible, horrible idea to do. I don't care what anybody says. I don't care if they think it's abuse and this and that. They don't know what they're talking about. And I'm gonna straight up I know some people watching this might not agree with that or like it, but I've seen too many that didn't do it. Looking at the reasons why you do it, it they're, uh, for uh, soft mouth, hard mouth, for uh, wounded birds, if they're dropping them at your feet, the bird could get away. There, there's so many different reasons. I'll list more right here if I can think of more that Chris talks about. But anyways, that this is why you do force fetch. You gotta do it. I get emails, I get Instagram messages, Facebook messages. Do you think I really gotta force fetch? force fetch yes do not skip force fetch please you will thank me later and you'll say you know what that really wasn't that big of a deal it wasn't it wasn't hurting the dog nothing so I'm gonna show Nathaniel what to do he's already watched Chris Aiken's video I'm just I guess I'm being part stingy because I want to do some stuff <laughs> hopefully you don't mind but here is what he made PVC two pieces of wood block you don't even really technically have to use something like that but what this does is encourages them to grab in the middle instead of, didn't you say she was kind of wanting to grab on yeah, the ends? Yeah, she'd want to grab the ends. Yeah, so. so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put pressure on her ear and for her to get rid of that pressure, she's gonna grab the bumper. Once she realizes that, hey, as soon as I grab that bumper, the pressure's off my ear, then it's, it's gonna start happening. It might be a little bit of struggle in this first session, but she's, if you guys already seen with the roller, she's already like wants to grab it. But what's gonna happen with this is she's really gonna, she'll be watching wherever you, Nathaniel moves this bumper, she's gonna wanna grab that thing. You don't have to say fetch yet. Sit, good girl, sit. Grab the ear and pinch. She's gonna be confused, kinda like, why are you doing this? Okay, I'll let off, give it a second. She's kinda like, not one under one when I'm doing this. Good girl. Oh, no, hold. She's literally not even letting me put it in. 
Being stubborn as a mule. Now, if that was a roller, she'd just grab it right away. That's fine. It's her first time. She's just trying to figure out why she's feeling that pressure. Here. Good, good girl. Hold. Hold. Good girl. Good girl. Okay. So that's her first time. Leave. Good girl. Good girl. Her tail's wagging. She's doing all right. Look good. at that lazy sit. Yeah. hilarious that she's actually fighting it now. Hey, here, let's try. I'm gonna start backwards. I'm gonna start backwards and I'm just gonna force it in. She's literally locked jaw. <laughs> Good girl, oh. Good girl. Good girl. See? That's all right. Good hold. girl. Hold. Hold. Good girl to hold. Yes. Leave. Good girl. Now, I will say something that I didn't think of beforehand. This is a new object. This is the first time she's grabbed this. That might be part of the problem. Actually, in fact, let's do something here. You gotta just always be thinking. Every dog's gonna be different. Let's see if this will help. Good girl. See, she grabbed that right up. Hold. Good girl. Good girl. Leave. Good girl. Yeah, see? Here. Hold. Hold. Leave. Good job. Good job. As soon as she figures out how that pressure goes away. <laughs> A lock jawed. <laughs> oh, she will not even want to grab it. Come on, come on, Tate. Good girl. There we go. Good job. She's being, totally being stubborn. Hold. Good job. Watch it up, Kill. Good girl. Good girl. Hold. Good girl to hold. Good girl. Good girl. Leave. Girl. All right, guys. We're sitting at about a week, maybe, since we started this. Maybe a week and a half. Yeah. Because we started hold. Now we're into the force fetch thing. Yeah. So that is a little different. But so I'm just giving you another update and see the progress. Because you guys watch this video and see the progress like this quick because it's a short video. But for Nathaniel doing the work, you can kind of get stuck in the phase where you feel like. Am I making progress? Yeah. You know? But this will help him go back and look later on like, wow, she she's doing so much better than she was on the last time they worked. And he's been working two, three times a day every day, pretty much. Maybe more. So he's doing great. She's doing great. But we keep trying to push for more progress. So now, still doing the ear pinch and we're getting her to reach. She's actually grabbing it. But now we're, we're wanting to get her to where we can stretch and get this farther and farther away from her. By the way, this is what he made. Uh, but that she'll be going for it and reaching for it, and then we can keep moving on. So here's progress. Barely yeah. Do you think by any chance this might be? Can she move enough if you wanted to hold it farther away? Like, try to stretch. Just see what she does. Like putting it like this far from her. Like something like quite a. No, not not that way because she can only go so far. Off to the side. Huh. Like. Good. Girl. Good. Good. Really got to get loud with the praise, dude. You okay. really got to like. Accelerate it. Hey, girl. She's holding good, though, huh? Yeah, she did She'll really sit, good. I've just let her set. She'll sit like that forever. Hold. <laughs> she almost dropped her. Mm, she won't that. do it, though. She knows. Hold. Sit. As hold. you can see, guys, she's barely. Now, Chris told me that's not a big deal. Leave. Nothing to worry about. I mean, of course, we all want him to hold really good, yeah. but, like, it's not the end of the world. Because when that comes to a duck and all that stuff, they, they're not letting that go of that. They ain't going to let go. Yeah. So, cool. Good. Yeah, That's progress. Now we're just trying to stretch it out farther and farther. 
All right, guys. This we're gonna wrap this up. We are get we're gonna move today to the next stage. But I wanted to show you guys since I haven't videoed it yet um, her progress with um, force fetch with ear pinch. She basically Nathaniel's not even having to pinch anymore. He's just um, she's going for it so quick and she's going across the bed of the tailgate of the truck. So let's just show him a couple before we move on to the next phase. Right here, pinch it up, pinch it up. Girl, fetch it up. And you don't even have to pinch it unless she's not going for it. Girl, leave. Here, pinch it up. Pinch it up. Hold, sit. sit. No, hold, sit. Good. No, hold. She's going all the way across leave. the top. Okay. Just do what you've been doing. If she's going for it quick, I mean, don't even have to bump her. You only make her sit every time? You don't have to, huh? -uh. Just get her wound up, dude. Get her wanting that thing. Here, fetch it up. Fetch it up. No, fetch it up. Fetch it up, sit. Hold. So good she does hold on it. Hold. Hold. It's been great. So guys, we just now went to back to bumpers because we're about to move to the ground. She's doing really good. And this is through the e-collar phase. Holding really good. Fetching it up quick. Alright guys, we're finally out here. We made it to this point. Force fetch is done. Working the dogs together, be working on Rocky's steadiness, and also for him to show Kelly, you know, kind of just be the, I guess, the experienced one. Got Jake and Morgan, Sarah, and Wave. Morgan and Braxton over there. Got some water training, it's perfect. So Morgan's gonna go over there with some ducks from last season that we thought out. Throw them over, we're gonna shoot with the blanks. Do the whole scenario, so. I'll send Rocky a few times first for her to catch the gist of it and also work on her steadiness and his too. All right, Rocky boys made a couple of trees in it. Got some ducks from last year. This is going to be Kelly's first official. She got to watch him twice, so this is going to be her first official time. Here we go. Walk out there with her in the pan. It's her first time. She'll get it. Get her worked up. Get her. <laughs> Good girl. Where's she going? Awesome. That's good. Can you tell That's, the with oh yeah, big time, yeah. In fact, she's jumping up there on the stand and everything with it in her mouth. That's good. That was good, dude. That you can't honestly expect see that almost was Rocky on his first hunt. Because of that coop. That was a whole long story, but anyways, that was really good. Sit. 
Almost had it that time. Go and get it from right down. Yeah, this is for Kelly, same spot. That was a perfect spot. Get out there, Nathaniel. Get out there, get her. Here, here, Kelly. Perfect. Let's get one good one, no drop, and we'll call it. Okay? For Kelly. Yeah, for Kelly. Rocky's done. Go ahead. Kelly! Good girl, here, fetch it. Good girl, kennel. Good girl. Hold, sit. Good girl. Leave. Hey, the girl. There we go. Nice. No, yeah, that helped. She just needed something to get done. There we go. Good girl, Kelly. All right, let's call it. We'll end on that good note. Good girl. Awesome. Kelly.